Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to be um, showing you how to download mods on Minecraft. Now I know most of you do know how to download mods on, My mods on Minecraft. So, um, this is only for people who maybe have just started playing Minecraft. Lots of you probably do play Minecraft. But if you don't know how to download mods, I'm going to make a tutorial on how. So first thing you want to do, you want to go to Google. And yes, I'm watching him. Um, and you want to type in your mod. So let's just say want twi... Light Forest Minecraft 4. Alright. So, this is the first thing you want to do. You want to go here and you need to download the mod first off. Just go to that. Okay. So, you're going to go here you're going to find the uh, version you need. Go with the shell. Let's just get an old version. Just, okay, you know what? We can do this. So, 4.1.7.10. Alright, so I'm gonna take it here. This, 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 I swear I hate this. And then I'm gonna click. Down? Oh, download. Alright. And if it says that, it's not gonna hurt it. Don't worry. You'll be fine. Alright. So then, the whatever you downloaded it for, like with a version, you have to go to Minecraft Forge. Minecraft Forge. And you're gonna go to the first one right here. Now, after you do that, you're gonna see all these. So, whatever mine was 1.7.10, I'm gonna click here. And then you're gonna click download latest. And uh, I like to install it with, I think it's not universal, I think it's just installer. I don't know someone else, so I hope this is what I usually download it with. Nope. Yeah, so you're going to click uh, download with installer. Alright, so then what you want to do is you want to go to your file explorer, which is this down here, this little file thing, and you're going to go click here, and you're going to type in percent app data percent, and then enter. So you're gonna see all these folders. Gonna click on your dot Minecraft folder. All right, you're gonna, you're not, um, if you never download mods, I'm pretty sure you're not gonna see a mod folder. So what you have to do is you just, uh, you uh, right click, right, uh, not on any of these. You right click and then you click, uh, new folder and you're gonna name it mods or you can really name it whatever, whatever you want to name it. So that's how you do that. Now with Forge, you don't have to put it in your mods folder. Forge. You have to drag to your desktop. So once you do that, you're gonna click. You're gonna double click on Forge. You're gonna see Minecraft Forge. You're gonna click on Install Client, and I'm not gonna do this because I did it. But once it gonna, it once it's just gonna start installing, and once it installs, you're just gonna click OK. It's gonna go. So. That's that. Let me just delete this. You don't need this any of any. You don't need this anymore. You can delete it when you're um, done downloading. Then you're gonna drag the mod that you downloaded into the mods folder that you created. And you can see I already have some mods in here. Um, but you drag the mod like that. And then what you want to do is you want to minimize everything. And then you're gonna go, uh, open your Minecraft. Alright, then what I'm going to do is you're going to click Edit Profile. See, I'm already on this, Forge. And you're going to be on whatever version you're on. So if you're on like, use for the shirts, you know, you're not going to see anything. But what you have to do is you have to go all the way down to the very bottom. And then you're going to see all of these forges, or however many forges you have downloaded. And you're going to um, you're gonna click on the one that you have. So I have this one. This is the one that works for it. I'm going to click Save Profile. And it's going to say down here, Ready to play Minecraft 1.7.10 Forge 10.13.2.1291. I'm just going to click play. There it goes. It's loading. Yeah, I thought it was load. No, I don't think I've ever played with all these mods, so I don't know if it's going to crash or not. It doesn't look like it's going to. 
Is it going to load? Okay, merging. And I have the texture pack on. So then you're gonna go, you're gonna see this, and um, if this worked, you're gonna see this thing called that says mods. You can click on that, and it's gonna show you all the mods you have. Child mods are small mods, but all the mods I have are not small. So, you know, that's what child mods are. So you're gonna load your thing, and you're gonna go to whatever you want. Let's just do a creative really quick. Super flat, and I'm gonna, you know, I'll just name it mod tutorial. And you're gonna do all your options and everything. And click save or create. Sorry, now, like I said, sometimes it'll crash if the mods aren't compatible with the right forge all together. If you have multiple mods and it's not compatible with the right forge, all of them, then it will crash. So I don't know if that's going to do it with mine. Nope. As you can see, you're going to be in here, and you should be able to say if you download an spawn, you know, you'll have all your Orspawn stuff, or if you have to play the forest, you're going to click this, and you have all your stuff. So yeah, that's how you do it. Um, it's, you know, it's really easy. It's not difficult at all, and it should be able to spawn your stuff. Use this, you know, whatever you need to spawn in, it should be there. And yeah, that's how you download mods in Minecraft. Uh, thanks for watching.